disturbing details emerging in the trial of a former teacher of the year accused of having sex with her then 12 year old student the young boy who turned 14 today spent most of the day on the stand facing his alleged abuser former mango elementary teacher Ethel Anderson. Our Serena Fazan joins us live from the courthouse with the very latest on this. Good evening, Serena. Good evening to you, Linda. The prosecution just rested its case, and in a surprise move, that teacher, Ethel Anderson, is on the stand right now. She is speaking, and earlier, as you mentioned, her alleged victim spoke. I felt like she was a real girlfriend. I loved her, that I was her boyfriend, that she loved me, and 30-year-old Ethel Anderson showed no emotion as her former student took the stand detailing their alleged intimate relationship. She would kiss me on my neck and ears and stuff like that. This and more the boy testified happening in Anderson's Riverview home where she privately tutored him, a home she shared with her husband, child, and even another teacher. The boy, now 14, says the relationship started just months after his 12th birthday, and it was him who did not want it to go any further. She would say that she wanted me so bad, and, you know, she wanted to go farther, but... I just didn't want to lose my virginity to a teacher. But Anderson's attorney painted another picture, saying the boy lied because he was infatuated with Anderson, even threatening her with allegations of a relationship. That if you told that she was going to lose her child, that's what you meant by that. Yes, I didn't want But then the boy's mother, who we are also not identifying, took the stand. She told the jury she actually saw inappropriate texts and alerted authorities. Deputies asked her to wear a wire and meet Anderson. Jurors heard the secretly recorded conversation. At first, Anderson denies the allegations. The mother remains calm throughout the entire conversation, although in court she wept after hearing it replayed. She kept pressing Anderson, who cried so hard it's hard to understand understand her reply. Did you catch him? Did you? Anderson eventually admits in the tape they had oral sex. Yes. A lot of emotion in just the past half hour. She's actually crying on the witness stand right now and claiming to the jury that she tried to ward off the boys' advances. We, of course, will bring more from what she says on the stand coming up on ABC Action News at 6. Reporting live from the Hillsborough County Courthouse, I'm Serena Fazan, ABC Action News.